Okay, here's some of my Halloween projects that are done. This is the new coffin. Tilted at an angle so it's going to look like it's popping up out of the ground. Put the little crow on top of it. There's one of the severed heads from a headless bride. She'll be holding that head. Those are going to be huge spider eggs for my huge three foot tall spider. She'll be sitting on top of those eggs. This is uh, my partial skeleton that I'm going to make look putrid. He's only partially done. Uh, there's a couple of my cement tombstones that I made from a mold. Uh, this guy I made last year. That's my alien. I made him from one of those cheapo low skeletons from Big Lots. There's my severed vampire head. That's my gargoyle. I didn't make that. I bought that. There's my Headless Bride. I made that. This is my Ghoul. I just bought the... It was just a, a head on a hanger. And I attached it to a tomato cage. Added some fabric and the skull there. Made them about so oh, five and a half feet tall. Give it some character. And I made this a couple of years ago. Just a spider web victim. You can tell he's been outside. He's got leaves all over him. And one of my burnt skeletons. My eyeball wreath. Thanks, Martha Stewart. Need to add some more eyeballs to it. Those fall off when it gets too hot. And that's it. For now. Oh wait. My fountain. I have to test it. Call this fountain of sorrow. It will spew blood when it's done. And that's it. <laughs>